Welcome to Y-Hub, the center of your curiosities. Today, we will answer one of the most fascinating and mysterious questions that humanity has always asked. Why do we fall in love? If you've ever wondered what happens in our mind and heart when we meet someone who makes our heart beat faster, this video is for you. When we meet someone we're interested in, the first reaction is often a strong physical attraction. But what happens in our body? The chemistry of attraction is driven by a mix of hormones and neurotransmitters, such as dopamine, which makes us feel happy and excited, and oxytocin, the bonding hormone. This combination makes us feel warmed and connected to someone, as if they are something special. From an evolutionary perspective, falling in love has a clear purpose, reproduction and the continuation of the species. In the past, our ancestors fell in love and bonded to ensure childcare and mutual protection. Humans, like many other species, are programmed to seek partners who can offer us healthy offspring and a safe environment to raise them. Beyond biology, psychology plays a key role in why we fall in love. Psychologists suggest that our emotional attachment may be influenced by past experiences, such as relationships with our parents and life experiences. This makes us subconsciously seek a partner who meets our emotional needs, ones we formed in childhood. Another interesting phenomenon is the idealization phase. When we fall in love, we tend to see the person we love through rose-colored glasses, attributing them idealized qualities. This happens because, during the process of falling in love, our brain releases high doses of dopamine, making us feel euphoric and causing us to see our partner as almost perfect. In this phase, we are so involved that we don't see the flaws. But love isn't just about chemistry and neurotransmitters. Over time, love evolves. After the initial passion phase, love turns into a deeper and more lasting bond. The key to this change lies in mutual trust, emotional support, and the affinity that develops over time. This type of love, less passionate but more stable, is essential for a lasting relationship. Finally, love is also influenced by cultural and social norms. Every culture has its own ideas about what it means to fall in love and love. Social expectations about who we can or should love, and how we should love, play an important role in our romantic choices. So, why do we fall in love? It's a combination of chemistry, evolution, psychology, and cultural influences. Falling in love is a complex and wonderful phenomenon that unites us as humans, making us experience one of the most powerful emotions that exist. Love pushes us to connect, grow, and share incredible experiences together. If you enjoyed this journey into the human heart, don't forget to subscribe to YHub, turn on notifications, and stay curious. New videos every week.